everyone, it's Honeywell, and we are playing Stardew Valley, and we are going to the desert today, which should be exciting. Uh, the fair is tomorrow. Uh, that's actually... Well, I have it worked out, but it's not working out. Uh, somewhat annoyed. That's a shame. <laughs> Living off the land, got any tapters? Yes. We've already done all that. Uh, uh, back to what we're doing. Um, we're gonna go ahead and take care of our chores. You would think working out every week would, uh, would do these people some good, but apparently not. <laughs> Would you like to come to dinner? Could you just bring the main course? <laughs> okay, Jody. Okay. Um, so we've been invited to dinner. And we can do this at any time. It doesn't have to be tonight. Um... 10 beats. Oh, nice. Is that a health portion? Yeah, 200 health. That's perfect timing. Thanks, Pam. And the fair is tomorrow. Let's get that sorted really quick. We had... I wanted to do... Um, there's eight categories, and you get a bonus. You get bonus points. Bonus uh, thirty points if you cover six out of the eight. So what I was, that's what I was trying to do with the fish, and I wanted to um, bring a food as well. That's another category, but we don't need to do that. Um, we have milk, which is an animal product, a mushroom, which is uh, foraging, a star fruit, which is fruit. Uh, fairy rose honey, which is artisan, diamond, which is mineral, pumpkin, which is uh, vegetable. So, since neither, none of these fish or are particularly, uh, we get a lot of points for any of these lower fish here, I'm just not going to do a fish. I can get um, more points. We have our categories. We have uh, six categories here. And I can get more points just including um, some more vegetables. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, so we are going to do a a yam and a cauliflower. Uh, the yam, cauliflower, and pumpkin will all give six points each. So that is plenty. Three, six, nine. And if we get a purple mushroom in the mines today, then we'll bring the life elixir. But if not, this is going to be our Grange display, and uh, it is perfectly fine. It is a perfectly serviceable Grange display, and we should win first place, which is the whole point, because you get more star tokens. Um, let us get our chores done and out of the way. Oh, do you know what? How many preserve jars do we have? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 32, 3, 4, 34. That's good. We'll just do 34. Of course, we weren't going to get a purple mushroom today in the mushroom cave. <laughs> That would have been too perfect. Uh, no. 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 Oh my god. Stop already. Uh, 
we are going to go ahead and do our morning chores, which is basically just uh, chopping wood, taking care of the animals. And then we will uh, hop on a bus, pick up some uh, star fruit, bring Sandy a birthday present, uh, explore the de desert a little bit. And we're not going to be too uh, too concerned about getting the most time in the skull mines. We're just really uh, dipping our toes in the water just to see what the combat is like. Combat. Um, but we're also hoping to uh, farm it like we would a normal mine uh, because we need we need eight more sprinklers for. For the greenhouse since we're getting star fruit seeds oh nice i don't like that there though we'll take care of that later hey guys let's get this stuff off of our inventory bar put that back where it belongs okay mm -hmm. Debbie, get out of the way. This is why I'm gonna take all this stuff out of here. It just makes it it just makes it take longer to uh, to process this stuff. Okay, ladies, you may come outside and play. Enjoy the day. Soon it will be winter. Good morning, cows. first. Uh, you first. Oh, come on. Why do you do this to me? We're gonna have to do this faster on the days that uh on days that we'd actually do want to go to the mine this is too slow okay we'll put that cheese in there that bucket in there good good and you may go outside to play as well enjoy the day We fiddled around though. Um, yeah, what is this stuff? We have a we have a duck mayo and a void mayo, so we don't need to keep any of those. Foraging. Um, these pomegranates are a favorite of Elliot's, so we want to keep them. Those candles in there, I'm sure we'll do something with them eventually. Okay, what was I doing? Uh, selling stuff. Sell that, that, that. Oh, why do I still have a void egg? And you see, we just picked up um, four cranberry seeds. So instead of 75 gold, we'll get, uh, what, 150? So it's a little bit of a profit, and we have a chance for an ancient seed. Uh, what do I want to do? I want all kinds of crappy fish. Is that good? I'm sure that's fine. Let's go make some sashimi. So 
I have any good fish in my inventory? No. Uh, yeah, this restores uh, 30 health, so we're just going to use this like health food. Um, and these are fine too. Like we'll top up with like berries and stuff. Um, but if we're being attacked, uh, 30 health is a lot better. <laughs> and if our energy gets really low, we can just take that tonic. So, uh, yeah. Is that everything? We have enough wood to make a chest. So let's just do that now. We can put that in there. And... Get rid of that void egg. Oh, and I almost forgot a present for Sandy. Uh, a gold sweet pea for you. Okay, yeah. That's good enough. Let's go. Obviously, if we were... Uh, if we were looking to make some progress in the skull lines, um, we would, we would want to leave... Uh, as early as possible. But we're just hoping to get some uh, gold and iron out of our trip. See what it's like. Hopefully not die. That will be, uh, that will be good enough for us. We'll collect uh, these coconuts and stuff. Uh, these are favorite gifts of Haley and Haley and Linus. Um, we found a book. There can't be too many more left. And Clay. Hey, Sandy. Nice to meet you. Hello, hello, sweetie. <laughs> but you're here to buy a whole bunch of sweet seeds, right? Right. That is exactly why I'm here. Also, happy birthday. You're welcome. And just like that, we should be friends with Sandy. Wow. Yeah, just like that. Three hearts. And uh, that's why you don't want to forget anybody's birthday. Okay, uh, what do we need? Uh, one... Let's do 54 starfruit seeds. Eventually we'll want to do more, but honestly, we don't have enough kegs to process this amount. So, so we're, we're absolutely fine to, to only do like half the greenhouse and starfruit. We're not going to lose out. Once we can uh, process more, we'll make more of an effort to, uh, to get those. We need 10 beets. 10 beats for the mayor. Um, but we have 13 spots, so let's get 13. And and that's it. She also, on Thursday, she um, sells Deluxe Speed Grow for only, I think I want to say it's 80 gold. Um, once we have our greenhouse like fully up and running and we have all the kegs that we want, we'll want to grow our star fruit on Speed Grow because we'll get three harvests instead of two. Um, and it makes it the most profitable thing you can put in your greenhouse. Now, somebody did something with like hops and fruit trees and something sort of configuration. Uh, but frankly, I'd rather like poke my eyes out with a fork than, than need like 300 and something kegs in order to process hops and like harvest hops every single day. Just shoot me now. That is not something we'll ever do. Okay, and uh, yeah. Let's. Do we want our hoe? No. Um, do we want all those? No, because chances, we have a good chance of dying. We just want one pepper popper. 
Oh, these heal 54 health. Eh, it's fine. Definitely our seeds. Put those away, those away. Yeah, that is good. There's our pepper popper for speed, just in case it runs out. Um, some healing, some emergency. And uh, let's go. Well, we are just uh, dipping our toes in here. We'll absolutely uh, take a ladder out uh, if need be. We're really just farming. Like, I hate these levels. These are mummy levels. But there's no mummies here. Very nice. Um, but we're looking for loot. We'll get a quest after this visit, like we got to join the Adventurer's Guild. We'll get a quest to, uh, oops. Wow, 16. Three, four, four hits. That's not as bad as I thought. Uh, we'll get a quest to get to level 25 in the Skull Caverns. And, and we'll get 10,000 gold for doing that. And these purple slimes have a good chance of well, uh, a chance of dropping, a chance of dropping iridium. So they're going to be our best bet for quite a while, unless we spend money of uh, getting iridium. Um, let's see. Good stuff. copper, iron. And I guess, well, let's do coal, copper, iron, stone. And now if we can just find some uh, golden iridium. Good, good. Oh, and our speed buff wore off, so let's do that. See, already see there's a a serpent uh, which I don't mind I don't want to die to them I don't want to be swarmed by them but I do want to kill them they have a chance of dropping some good stuff like that spicy eel is a uh, is luck and speed food we want that I'm not going to use it this time just because just because we just put on a speed buff um, but our next trip, we'll save those up for that. There it is. Oh no. Good luck, Honeywell. We were going to find out if we're going to die. scary. I can see this is going to be hard to progress. If we're super careful, we shouldn't have a problem, it looks like. Um, but we're not going to be very fast. Uh, it's going to be kind of like the early days on the mine when we had that stupid... When we had that stupid, rusty wooden sword and rusty sword where we were uh, running by all the mobs that we could just because they took so long to kill. Uh, that's the, what we have going on here. Come on. Uh, no, let's go get the treasure. We're almost here. Thank you. 
Oh shoot. Um Go down the ladder. <laughs> yeah, okay, dangerous. We were denied all that beautiful loot too. Oh, uh, but we live. What is it, seven o'clock? sword. I don't see how we're going to be able to really progress without it. We're not going to be able to kill anything fast enough. Look how hard they hit too. Yeah, we're gonna have to get that sword, I think. We're not gonna get anywhere if we don't, is what I'm thinking. And it's uh, really dangerous. Like, look at that. Iridium, though. Um, but our health. Yes, please. Yeah. If we're super careful, we can kill these guys. Um, but swarms are dangerous too, just because they take so long to... Uh, Oh no. Um, because if they take so long to kill, then you have like a whole bunch spawned at once, which we can obviously not handle. I just want to be next to this way down, just in case we're overwhelmed. Oh, you s sneaky. That's not even right. More iridium, nice. Um, and on a good luck day, they would probably drop more. And if we had the burglar ring, uh, they would have a chance to drop loot twice. They would roll the loot table with the loot drop twice. So, uh... I guess we want to leave at 12 so we have time to uh, let the animals 
uh, lock up the animals and that sort of thing. And uh, I'm really kind of disappointed with just the the ore. I was hoping to kind of, uh, yeah, like this right here for uh, for gold and whatnot. These mummies can really hurt hard. I think we should just go down. Uh, you know what? Let's... This is better. This is what we should have done. We should have just stayed on the first floor and uh, com reset this floor over and over again. I bet we would have gotten more loot. We should have farmed it just like we would usually farm uh, the regular mines, the same floor over and over again. Uh, live and learn. Where are you at? I guess we're not gonna, we're gonna leave. Okay, that was fun. Um, three Iridium. I guess we'll just leave the bombs here. And that. And this energy tonic. Uh, and this shimi. Right? we want the seeds okay that's good Why are so have you noticed our, our pepper poppers used to last all night and now they don't seem to both two days in a row now they've worn off before the day ended that's a little disappointing Or maybe I'm just red. Uh, maybe I've just been better at like reapplying the, the little buff. Uh, so close to so close to an iridium bar. Um, enough for gold. Enough for one gold. Oh no. Okay, gold and that. Good, good. Um, I guess we'll clean this up as best we can. Two hundred hardwood. That's nice. Good, good. Uh, kind of a... I think we're going to just uh, farm the, the skull cave, just like we would um, the regular cave. Instead of trying to uh, to necessarily get deep into uh, the skull caverns, we might just farm like the first couple floors, just pick everything and reset the floor over and over again. And we'll have a chance of uh, monster drops and, and iridium. And then when we have enough money to, um, to buy a bunch of bombs and and stone for staircases, uh, then we can do like a proper uh, get down deep into the mine sort of thing. Should be fun. I'm a, I am not displeased with that. And if we keep it to the first floor, then we don't really need to worry about our sword too much because, because why? Oh, 
bedtime already. We won't worry about our sword too much because we can just uh, leave if we need to. Yeah, all in all, I'm pretty pleased. Uh, no, you're not sleeping on the floor. Get into bed. Good. Good job. Okay, another day done. Um, look at our uh, tallies real quick here. There we go. And uh, that was not bad at all uh, for a first trip, I don't think, just to check it out. Uh, today is the fair, so... Uh, but we're going to end the episode. It just makes it easier to upload and all of that good stuff. Okay, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for the likes and the comments. And I hope you'll come back for the next one. Bye-bye.